We're learning more about COVID-19 by the day. There is still a lot of misinformation out there. That's why we're helping you to separate fact from fiction. Channel 3's Eva Zamaris joins us now to break down our first claim of the morning. Eva? Well, good morning to Eric. The claim, Smithfield Foods was recently sold to China. The hogs will still be raised here in the U.S., but slaughtered and packaged for sale in China before being sent back to the States. It's time to fact check. This is fiction. Smithfield Foods does not import any products from China to the U.S. The company said over the weekend it's closing its pork processing plant in South Dakota until further notice after hundreds of employees tested positive for the coronavirus. After the announcement was made, social media users shared that false claim hundreds of times. Those posts said, read before buying meat. But get this, that claim has actually been circulating online for years now. Smithfield Foods was sold to Chinese pork giant WH Group back in 2013. A spokeswoman for Smithfield Foods says none of their products come from animals raised, processed, or packaged in China. She went on to say all of their U.S. products are made in one of their nearly 50 facilities here in the States. Now, the company's president and CEO says the closure of this facility and other plants across the industry is pushing the country very close to the edge in terms of meat supply. And coming up in our next half hour, we're looking at this claim. I can get the coronavirus from my pet. Let's see if that's true or false with more fact from fiction. Evans Maris, Channel 3, Eyewitness News. Eyewitness News this morning. We'll be right back after the break.